Ambulance four, go ahead and show me a morale to that latest nine one one. I think the postal was ten thousand six. Ah, fuck. Postal ten thousand six. So 10,006, gonna be right over here. Follow me over my NDT. Passerby seeing a crashed AV, ATV on the north side of the river. The caller did not see anyone at the location, but is worried that someone might be injured nearby. Oh. North side also, I need to. And what's four is going to be on scene of that nine one one. So the NDT said the north side of the river. So it looks like it's going to be possibly on that side. Hmm. Yeah, I can see. So if that's west. I'm trying to get over there in the ambo. This is Jank. <laughs> Two four, should we back to the river?
users are disconnected from your channel. Radio signal lost. Crap. Radio signal acquired. Yay! It sucks when you have a call out here and you can't fucking find it. Reference to number one. One more time. On the north side of the river. Ten thousand six. Oh, <laughs> fucking blind. Got an ATV, then we have a suspect. Can anybody hear me? Hello? Can anybody hear me? Oh. There we go. We got you, bud. Let's cover that too. Slash. Ouch. Hey, buddy, can you hear me? You know where you're at right now? <laughs> mm, Kentucky. A little off, sir. <laughs> Just a little off. I'm on one call. Holding.
Nee, ist der Eifer. I bud set out, I gotta run back up the hill and grab some supplies. We'll get you checked out. Oh, this is... There it is. User joined your channel. Perhaps. Three policy for not delays now one. I advise on Amelia's dressed in all black. Two David two, I just had a vehicle speed down westbound East Joshua Road. Vehicle uh, unknown color. Vehicle's gonna have green underglow on it. Still heading westbound on Joshua Road. Phone sticking out. Bleeding stops. I'll make contact with the subject. Wise. I'm about three, Mike, so Simba. Laser remaining back line 24-7. Voices. Splint. Mm. Hold. Is he going to be at the Route 68 in Harmony? Okay, so he's taking off on the bike. He's going to be heading eastbound on his black motorcycle. He's going to be a white male wearing all black. Two David two. He just passed by me. He's heading eastbound Route 68. Puts. Buddy, I know some of this, some of this stuff's gonna be really uncomfortable. All right. Okay. Oh. Ow. Uh, you just made a left onto Panorama Drive. Now he's heading northbound, Panorama. If they're overtaking primary. I'm making a right. We're now going to be in Smoke Tree Road and Panorama Drive. He's found making a left. <laughs> Coming back out of Panorama from Smoke Tree. Took it a right Panorama northbound, heading towards East Joshua. All right, sir. Let's get you back up the hill on the ambulance here. So drag eighteen. Don't 
Das ist so Ding. All right, sir, my uh, associate in the back is going to be helping you out. We're going to be taking you to the pillbox, all right? Mm -hmm. We actually stopped instead of waypoint. Two pillbox and pillbox is gonna be right there. Today is October, and my name is Tyler Perry. I'm in the sky right now. That's a lot of information on the heart rate. So, should have took the highway. So, how's he doing back there, Jimmy? <laughs> not very good. Not very good at all. Seems like he has a massive head injury. Not very good at all. That's fucking great.
Christ. <laughs> Those notifications scared the shit out of me. Alright, so this is Tyler, I believe my associate told me. He has a possible head injury. His right arm appears to be broken and the bones are showing and his right leg is broken at this time. Yep, there you go. Have him. Take him. <sighs> oh. Poof. Go back to RTO now. Disregard shots were not fired. He just tried to fire the USB uh, two minutes. He just did just fall off. Ten four. Two zero two has eyes on the subject. It's gonna be it's gonna be right below. On it's gonna be on, I believe, far left. It's gonna be on the roof. Uh, 10 four. can we go ahead and have uh, EMS roll down here, please? 10-4. 10-4, ambulance 2, it's going to be responding. And for um, route code three. Do you have a two subjects gonna have a fading pulse administering CPR now? User joined your channel. Where's my officer at? It's right, <sighs> right here. here. This is Jeremy. He's unresponsive. He uh currently has no pulse. I've started CPR about a minute ago. Both legs broken, broken ribs, and a broken arm. What's his injuries? Um, even I don't know that yet. Still waiting on a response. I'm using my eyes currently as I'm, as I'm doing CPR. I'm going to just upload the stuff to my uh, computer and watch it. Go ahead. Do you need a paramedic on scene? Dan, for you want to go ahead and roll out here? <laughs> Yay. Alright, so it looks like his face is going to be pretty bashed in, along with other crushed body parts. Is it possible he got ran over? I'm no clue. I'm trying to figure out what his injuries were caused from and what they are. But he does look fucked up, so. Yeah. Doesn't go into much. Overall, fucked up. <sighs> Let me get my medic kit over here and see if I can get him cleaned up. <sighs> Apologize for 
all too forward to that arriving unit. Slow down uh, so you you don't crash. <laughs> I got the road open on the left side. Perhaps not good. Squad four is on location. Yay! Uh. to the unit in the SHP, Tahoe. Good. If you want to move here, Tahoe, what are you doing? towards uh, my location. Come to uh, I don't know. He's not right living, back. man. I've been Where doing CPR he? for about two minutes. He's right here. He might need to uh, come back and then lay down. Over here. <laughs> okay. Or not. <laughs> I have no idea where this guy is. We're over here. <laughs> I see a speed charger. Over here. Right, right here. Are you talking about for the suspect? Where's this? Right, right here. Oh, the suspect. This is officer. Okay, where's the suspect? He's up there. And we need your help with the officer. Okay. Try um, saving Jeremy. Sweet. Maybe the EMT can go uh, deal with the subject. Yeah, if you want to find a suspect, I'll uh, I'll see what's going on with him. What happened to him? I have no clue, but he's all types of fucked up, no pulse. Okay. <laughs> all types of fuck. You didn't see what happened? Ambulance for to the units on scene of non two four. Where's the suspect going to be located? To the two subjects going to be located on the far left, right on top of the roof towards the end of the building. Found you. There you go. Thanks. All right. So, so what we got here? We can get them off this roof. Yeah, uh, he lost his pulse. I did started chest compressions, got it back, so I stopped that. Uh, he does have his both both of his legs are broken. Does have broken ribs and his arm is broken. Do we know he what does the uh... have, uh, his pant legs is heavily uh, bleeding through his pant leg heavily on his shin. <laughs> I'm gonna get ready to uh, start. On that leg. <laughs> and then we also have to get a seat collar on him. Yeah, so right here in my bag, you'll find the seat collar. I'm just going to check out this leg here, see how bad it is. Okay. Alright, so we got heavy bleeding on his left shin. Let's see if we can get a tourniquet on it really quickly. That's a gash. We could probably try putting gauze on it as well. Yeah, we'll but see. Let's see what I got. I have no fucking clue what I'm doing here, okay? I'm three days in this job. Flash me. How? Tries to apply. I'll put the tourniquet on his neck if you keep fuck with me. Tries to wrap. Shin does bleeding. Stop. Are slow.
All right, we got that slowed down. Hey, I don't know who's climbing the ladder, but you can't come up that way. Where do I gotta go? Here, come yeah. on the other side of the, come on the opposite side of the building and just jump on my car and jump up. Yeah. Here. <laughs> Good idea. Good point from these. Oh, go. God, I wasn't made for this. What's going on? Uh, what's going on? Uh, this guy literally jumped off from up there, uh, like uh, the top Ryan. up there. Yes. What's what you seen so far? Broken leg, broken rib, and we had heavy bleeding on his left shin, but I've got it wrapped up and slowed it down. Do you have a tourniquet on or the wrapping do you find? Just wrapping, slowed it down enough, in my opinion. Okay. Uh, any airway or breathing problems? I have not checked yet. Okay. Sir, can you hear me? Airway. Is he conscious? All right. He has not said a thing since I've been here, so. Okay. Check the area. other person uh, was in cardiac arrest. Now he's back uh, conscious. He has an IV and he's in on backboard in the back of the ambulance. So you said uh, the patient fell? That's what they told me. Yeah, he jumped from the top of this thing. Okay. Um, I'll go get a. Uh, Actually, Wood, can you grab another backboard from the ambulance? We'll backboard him and get yep. him moved. Sweet. This is going to be tricky to get him down. Yeah, we're just going to have to feed the backboard down. We'll make sure he's really webbed on there tightly. All right. His airway is uh, clear, by the way. Okay, sweet. He's breathing. Let's see. It's labored breathing. I'll listen to lung sound see if there's anything abnormal. <laughs> 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 He's making noises. Please, for the love of Oh, shit. Oh, here you go. Thank you. Um, Ryan, if you could start getting him on the backboard, I'm going to see what's wrong with his breathing. He uh, has blunt trauma to the chest, so he could have bleeding in there. Um, leading to like a tension pneumothorax or uh, something like that, where uh, or yeah, uh, you could have like a collapsed lung too or something. So, might end up doing a needle decompression. Huh. All right, there we go. <clears throat> All right, sweet. Uh, just get him webbed on there really tightly uh, with the spider straps. Make sure that he's not going to fall off. This is going to be a weird move. Straps. Down. 10 4, stand by because we got another patient that needs to go as well. Sweet. All right, let's get him moved down. All right, I'm going to stand down here and. Uh, Get one more person down here, and they'll help ha hand the backboard down to us, okay? All right, I got it. There you go. Yep. Careful, careful. I got him. All right, and then I'll hand him down to y'all. Okay. Okay, sweet. Let's go. That works. <laughs> huh. All right, if you want to get in the front, just head to the ambulance. Yep. This is some jank. You want to give me a ride towards my vehicle? Yeah. Uh, well, let me... Are you going to follow him or you want me to follow him? Um, 
or we well, both. Well, I mean, follow. whoever was the primary should follow. Oh. Primary's dead. I'm not, I'm not sure right. where the primary Yo, is. Yo, Nita, hurry up! He's dead! The primary hey, is. Okay. He's not dead to yet. David yes, he is. He's dead. He's not it's dead yet. He's three. not dead yet. He's a dead retarded. He's on mate. the Lucas right know. now. No, he's dead. Right. I gave him ten minutes back to the ambulance. He's oh dead. my god. He's, he's a dead not... retarded man. No. Who was? Who was the primary? He's a very special man, dude. He's a retarded man. Oh, right, gotta get him down a pillbox. They'll be able to save him. Oh, oh, save him. Not... We're gonna go to Mount Zona because it's closer to here. Got the waypoint set? Yep. Gotta turn around. Three, four, two, so. four. You guys going to the pillbox? Medic 4 is going to be transporting two patients. Priority 1 to Mount Zona Medical Center. Need two trauma activations. One patient CPR in progress. The other is uh, just... Hey. Trauma. God. Alright. Uh, let's... Is Osprey still in the back here with us? Osprey, you still with us? Three four two four escorting uh, the ambulance. Hey, Mount Zona, this is Medic 4 calling for two patient care reports. Alright, one patient is going to be a uh, adult male, uh, not conscious, but breathing. We're going to be a uh, general blunt injury to the chest, one left-sided needle decompression performed, and uh, bleeding control to the right leg for a major injury. Uh, it was arterial bleeding, but controlled with a pressure dressing. Uh, that patient is going to have stable vitals. Um, that's going to be tacky at 120 and uh, so, uh, stable blood pressure. Um, the second patient is going to be a post rosk traumatic arrest. He's going to have an IV in the right AC with uh, epinephrine and atropine administered, as well as fentanyl and ativan uh, administered um, post rosk uh, is coded twice, gotten ROSC both times, currently has a low pulse that atropine has been administered, had a seizure, uh, fell from a height of approximately 50 feet. Right now his vitals are a pulse rate of 45, blood pressure of 60 over 30. Um, we have a bag of fluids as well, about 500 milliliters. That was really close. <laughs> Uh, 3, 4, 15, can I get a 10, 15, Me too, he's gonna be approximately 5 minutes and we uh, get 10, 8, some trauma activations needed. To, uh, 9, 3, 4, <laughs> hey man, you good? You alright, Nightman? <laughs> okay, what can happened? you tell me where we are? You <laughs> fell, I think. Uh, Jeremy, you all right? Uh, Obvious head injury, then. Oh, is this our hospital here? Where's our hospital? Right here. All right. All right, Ryan, let's get him out. I'll take the officer if you can take the Batman like figure. Yep.
Uh, your patient's now conscious and breathing. He's post-ROSC. He's coded twice. Got ROSC both times. Patient's going to be adult male. Um, fell from a large height. Uh, coded. Got ROSC. Uh, he had a seizure. Um, we gave fentanyl and Ativan. Uh, fentanyl due to pain and then Ativan after he sees. Coded again. Got ROSC again. Uh, low pulse rate and uh, low blood pressure. So we've given a bag of saline and we've given atropine and epinephrine. His blood pressure is still low and his pulse rate is still fast. Uh, second patient also fell from a large height. going to have one injury to the chest, left side of needle decompression. Uh, his vitals are uh, fairly stable. He's got a high blood pressure and he's tachycardic. However, he's uh, maintaining uh, his... Uh, his blood pressure right now. Um, I didn't get access on him, but uh, he's just started to regain consciousness, but he's still disoriented. Okay. <sighs> All right. Thank you, boys. Decontaminate the ambulance and stuff. Oh, my ah! God. Wait, so now what do I do? I'm here to visit. I'm here to visit Jeremy. Is Jeremy he's, okay? He's dead. He's dead. Is is Jeremy he's gonna dead. be okay? No. Alright, I'm gonna wipe down the uh, wipe down the stretcher. Yeah, he's dead. Hey, he's Mr. Mr. EMT, is Jeremy gonna be okay? <laughs> is Jeremy is is that his blood? Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. Jeremy's gonna be okay. This is going though, right? to the to the county, Emmy. Uh, so uh, great job, Ryan. <laughs>